years. All right, Nick, thank you so much. Well, a local organization is hard at work tackling the emotional, physical, and financial toll placed on caregivers across our region. November is National Family Caregivers Month, and Age of Central Texas is hosting the She Thrives Summit to kick off the month and help caregivers. Now, that summit will take place one week from today. It is free to attend, and to tell us a little bit more about it is Jaden Beatty from Age. Thank you so much for being here. Of course, thank you. Okay, let's dig into some data really quickly. According to a recent study by AARP, the unpaid care provided by millions of caregivers here in our state, in Texas, is valued at $41 billion. So that's a huge financial toll. This summit is really going to help caregivers navigate these obstacles. So what's the mission? Yeah, so the majority of those unpaid caregivers you speak of are women. Mm. And we know that the real job of a family caregiver, put simply, is to put their arm around their loved one and walk them home. And so She Thrives is here to make that walk home as joyful as possible for the caregiver and their loved one by giving them the education, community, and support they need to thrive on that journey. Oh, and community is so important. So you all work with caregivers. What are some of the biggest issues, Jaden, that you all are seeing that they face here in our, our area? Yeah, so we're seeing issues around mental health and physical health that comes from caregivers not taking care of themselves. And the root cause behind a lot of that is they're not prepared for their caregiving mm. journey. We're not talking about it early enough and we're not preparing for it. And so She Thrives in Age is trying to empower the community with what they need to proactively approach that journey and prepare for what's to come so that way they can make better choices later on. Okay, and something I love about this conference, the three, the pillars that you all are focusing on, mm -hmm. mind, body, and soul, mm. so important. So how can people really, especially caregivers, uh, improve their mental health, their physical health, even when they're going through all of these things? Yeah, so the first step is pay attention to it. Mm. You've got to prioritize yourself. We'll have subject matter experts at the summit share for loneliness in particular, how you can use fitness, engage with your community, and also how to recognize when loneliness might be a symptom of a greater issue like depression mm. and how to use medical care to help. Okay, okay, and we know that this is a free Free, yes. free, keyword yes. free, right, Jaden? <laughs> okay, She Thrives, the Art of Aging Summit, November 1st, 2023, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. And the location, it'll be on Bluffstone Lane in Austin, Texas. And it is important to point out that it's virtual and in person. So there are those two options. We have that link there on our screen, but we'll also have that on our website for you to register if you'd like to attend. Jaden, thanks so much of for course. being here. Thank you. Well, coming up right now, the thrill of the Rangers heading to the World Series has left fans on cloud nine, including one man who showed Sophia Beausoleil just how much he loves the team. And this is part of my uh, shirt collection. Baseball is more than just a game for some. It's a it's a passion. It's a lifestyle. And there's no questioning Alejandro Nuno's loyalty to sports. I love the stars, the Rangers, FC Dallas. 